Praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. We'll rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. Heavenly Father, we worship you. We magnify you. Awesome God, mighty God, our God, our Savior. Thank you for the privilege of life. Thank you for the opportunity to be in your presence. Bless us this morning. Let your name be glorified. Let your power be revealed in our life. Minister to someone today, set captives free. Let today's morning devotion and time in your presence be a time of the prophetic, a time of healing, a time of deliverance to the glory of your name. In Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. I'd like to welcome everyone to Morning Glow today. Trust in the Lord that you will be blessed. You will be favored. The name of the Lord will be glorified in your life. The hand of the Lord will be stretched in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus. From wherever you have joined this morning, we celebrate, appreciate, thank God for you. May I ask you to please take the time to... Welcome so many people. Invite them, invite them, invite them. Don't stay silent. Have you noticed? God will not send angels after he sent angel Gabriel to proclaim the good news of the birth of Jesus because the gospel is a mystery to angels. So he expects us to do it. And so if we stay silent, the world will be in darkness. And Jesus is the only way, the truth, and the life. No man can come to the Father but by him. So please don't stay silent. Share. Morning glow. Let somebody come. Let them see the power of God. Experience the power of God. Let it begin the work of deliverance, salvation in their life. Don't say, oh, they are unbelievers. I tell you, everybody loves prayer including those who may even announce that they are atheistic. There are moments of challenges. All they want is to see a hand that is bigger than them, and they will believe. Praise God. I'd like to welcome you one more time. Wherever you have gone from, let us know. May the veil, Northwest London, blessings. Malaysia, God bless you this morning. Hackney, London, blessings on you in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord for everyone, wherever you've joined from. Let us know, Waltz and Cross, God bless you. Morgan Estate, Nigeria, blessings. Stratford, the Lord bless you. Sacramento, California, blessings. München in Germany, the Lord bless you. Norwich in, here in the UK, well I say here because Morning Glow is UK, God bless you richly. Catford, Southeast London, blessings, Arizona. Hey, the Lord bless you all the way from uh, Arizona, the USA, blessings. Middleton Cork in Ireland, blessings. Bush Hill Park in Enfield, God bless you. Durban, South Africa, Saubona, Celanti, Michigan, blessings on you. Jesus' name, Oshobo, Nigeria, blessings. Rabo Shekaya de 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 da. Soweto, South Africa, Saubo Nakunjani. New London Estate, Barua, Nigeria. All right. All right. God bless you there in New London. Lilongwe, Malawi. Be blessed. Nile Favor. Kafwe in Zambia. The Lord bless you. Jalango, Nigeria. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be favored. Nabedo Shindia da da. Talere Bokoso Taya. Aliko uh, Zombori Portsmouth, UK, be blessed and favored. Magboro, Ogun State, Nigeria, blessings. Wellenbra in Middleton, in, in Midlands, I beg your pardon. God bless you. Venetia in Italy, pronto. Uh, the Lord bless you this morning. Praise the Lord. Vundok Namibia. May you be highly favored in Jesus' name. Okaya Desha, Kozora Tata, Coventry, West Midlands. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you richly. Jabi, Abuja, Nigeria. Blessings on you. Pretoria, South Africa. Saubona, God bless you. Praise the Lord. Ayene Kabaro, Strood and Kent. Blessings. Clapton and Hackney. Blessings. Hoxton and Hackney. Blessings. 
Rochester, Kent, blessings. Cross River, Nigeria, blessings. Bottomwood, blessings. Stanwell and Staines, blessings. Praise the Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Cordoba in Spain. Dios te bendiga. God bless you. Houston, Texas. Be blessed, be blessed, be blessed, be blessed this morning. Tulsa, Oklahoma. Uh, God bless you richly. Someone Tulsa, Oklahoma says, still waiting for Pastor Matthew. It's a long time I went to Tulsa. Logan in France. When was the last time in Tulsa? I think it must be something like 1993. That's a long time, you know. 1993. Yeah, I think so. Blessings on you this morning. Rochester, Kent. Be blessed and I'll favor Kukum Limli, Accra, Ghana. God bless. Be blessed. Uh, Ehechiowa Arochuku. Nigeria, God bless you richly. Palonde Yani Kaba Dorushkia, also Stream Shropshire, blessings, blessings. Bogner Regis in West Sussex, God bless you. Bogner Regis has a very special memory somewhere in my heart. In the, the first hundred and out of my 110 books, which I have written, the first 50 were published by a man who has his office in Bogner Regis, New One Press. God bless you richly, 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 richly. Custom House East London. God bless you richly. Kofuri Dua Ghana. Be blessed and highly favored. Aino Shaniza Liburo Tarira. Eden Vale in South Africa. Saubona Sutton in Sorry. Be blessed and highly favored this morning. Nebro Shekaye Taliriba. Zero ndere kabare rosari kayada de rosande. We declare favor on somebody today. Paddock Wood in Kent, the Lord bless you. San Ramon, California. Blessings on you, praise the Lord. Broadwater Farms in Tottenham, the Lord bless you richly. Dublin in Ireland, be blessed in Isle Favor. Eden Gardens, Nigeria, Lekki. Blessings. Fort Portal City in Uganda. God bless you richly. I have a village in the UK. Blessings. Uh, Togo. Uh, you didn't mention the city. God bless you. Gulu in Uganda. God bless you this morning. We are declaring blessings on everyone on the platform. In the mighty name of Jesus. Rico Tebe Yani Tali Baru Tali Dadi Kabari Toro Nama Kesan Tali Re Barata Loro Tali Re Kaka Kabarate Ayabo Darebo Dawaki Extension Abuja Blessings on you in the name of Jesus Pokwase in Accra God bless you richly this morning Winnipeg Manitoba the Lord bless you richly Jesus there I was in Winnipeg two Februarys ago it was uh, no I was there last year also two Februarys ago or three it was zero degrees they said it's warm today zero is warm God bless you bro praise the Lord Lusaka Zambia God bless you Jesus name Nambeloja Zambrodosia he queer bounds green hey the lord bless you this morning it's a long time i went to bounds green used to visit members there many years ago when i was a younger pastor there in london kingston vale the lord bless you richly this morning we like to celebrate to welcome everyone who's joining us this morning we trust the lord to minister to you bless you in the mighty name of Jesus, the hand of the Lord. Uh, God will trouble your trouble this morning. Please make sure you have your communion bread and wine ready. Because we will seal our victory over the troubles. Your eyes will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Your mouth will testify. Victoria Gasteiz in Spain. Dios te bendiga. 
I bless you this morning. So get ready your communion bread and wine. South Africa, Cape Town. Hey, the Lord bless you this morning. God will trouble your troubles. Why will God trouble your troubles? Because they trouble the Lord. Your troubles trouble the Lord because your burden is not your burden. It is the burden of the Lord. It is the burden of the Lord. Nakayito di zunga idaba talero dabare telere baka. Jano jani jini bro sali rede talara sanabaro toro zikia. Ebora. Eko shande kadero. Listen to the Lord. Uh, Isaiah 63 verse 9 in contemporary English version. It says it troubled the Lord to see them in trouble. And his angel saved them. I love this one. It troubled God to see me in trouble. We are using anthropomorphic word to describe God. God cannot be troubled by anything, but it troubled him that I was troubled. So we use human language to describe an eternal God. It troubled the Lord to see them in trouble. And his angel saved them. The Lord was truly merciful. So he rescued them in his arms and carried them all those years. It troubled the Lord to see them in trouble in, in Egypt. So he, says, he sent his angel and saved them. He showed them mass mercy. He rescued them and carried them in his arms all through the wilderness. Underneath the, the everlasting arms of God. When God, when when the children of God are facing life's challenges and deliverance does not seem to come on time, there is the temptation to feel that, oh, maybe God does not care about me. Oh, maybe I sinned. Uh, but I want you to know this. God will intervene. And he intervenes not in my time, but in his time. And I tell you, his time is best. When Job experienced silence from God through his trials, until towards the end, because if you read uh, the book of Job, everything going on, Job did not hear from upstairs. He did not hear from the big one. He just had his friends, he saw the hand of the enemy, he cried, he said everything. If you slay me, I will yet worship you. Mm -hmm. God did not say anything until towards the end. Listen, you are not alone. God will trouble your trouble and give you testimony. You will still laugh at last. It was only towards the end, somewhere around chapter 23 of Job. And you see from chapter 1 to 23, it's not one day, it's not one week. The guy has been sitting on the rubbles of his house for a long time, man. And so Job said in chapter 19, 22, my complaint today is still a bitter one. And I try hard not to groan aloud. If only I knew where to find God. Oh, jeez. The guy was just, if only I knew where to find him. I will go to his throne and talk with him there. New Living Translation. I will lay out my case and present my arguments. Then I will listen to his reply and understand what he says to me. <laughs> He da, 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 da. Would he merely argue with me in his greatness? Job 23, verse 2 to 7. No, he will give me a fair hearing. Yeah, fair. And honest people can reason with him. So I will be acquitted by my judge. God did not say anything. Sometimes when we face things, we wonder how, where, when. But I came this morning not to emphasize the trouble, but to let you know even when it seems like he's quiet. He's working because Jesus too in humanity, in human flesh, went through what I'm telling you now. That's why he screamed out, Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani, my God, my God, why have you forsaken me? Jesus, the Son of God, felt the same way. Uh, Job again in Job 23 verse 8 to 10. Said, I go east, but he's not there. I go west, I can't find him. I do not see him in the north, for he is hidden. 
I turn to the side, but I can't find him. But he knows the way that I am going. And when he has tested me like gold in a fire, he will pronounce me innocent. Oh, I don't think I've read this story of Job in this translation before. It just brings it alive. He said, I've gone to the east. I didn't find him there. I've been to the west. I cannot find him. I didn't see him in the north, for he is hidden. I turned to the south. I can't find him. But this morning, I want you to know, eventually when God spoke to Job, he found happiness. He found joy. He found peace. And then God restored everything he had lost. This morning, I want you to know the Lord will restore everything you have lost. You live in the valley of hope, and hope will come to you. In the name of Jesus, in Hosea 2.15, God said, I will return her vineyard to her. Transform the valley of trouble into a gateway of hope. My God, Hosea 2.15, write it down, write it down, write it down. God said he would turn your valley of trouble into a gateway of hope. So when people are laughing that you are going through a valley of trouble, suddenly the same valley will become your gateway of hope. I will return her vineyard to her. God said he will return your vineyard to you. What is a vineyard? It is a place where you turn grapes to wine, where you turn produce to possibilities, where you turn grace to the thing of celebration i will return her vineyards to her and then i will transform the valley of her trouble to become the gateway of hope that's your story that's your portion in the name of jesus listen no matter what you go through proverbs 8 29 the lord will never allow the sea to go beyond the boundaries drawn for her that trouble will not kill you. You will overcome it. You will rise above it. You will testify. And we're sealing our victory with the blood and the body of the Lord this morning. Somebody will have a testimony. You will have a testimony. You will have a testimony. For the hand of the Lord will be stretched. The glory of the Lord will be seen. The only thing is, you want the Lord to trouble your trouble. You can't just sit down and do what you like. You got to repent, give your life to Christ. You got to renounce your past life, have a relationship with God. Invite Jesus into your life as a mark of seriousness. As a mark of seriousness. And then don't just say, I'm worshiping online. When there is a strong Bible believing church near you, enter, start worshiping. Don't stay home. Do not forsake the gathering of the brethren as the manner of some people is. The time has come. God's blood word will bless you. Your life will be a different one, a testimony, a glorious one, a powerful one. He knows the way that I take. Oh my take Oshatayada. He calls over or take care for those of people, those of you like Job who have looked for him in the west and you've looked for him in the north. You searched for him in the, in the south and you looked for him in the east and you didn't find him. The Lord's out. I want you to know he's close to you and he will stretch his hand. He'll prove himself mighty. Father, we give you glory. We thank you for deliverance the first time. We thank you for deliverance the second time. We thank you for deliverance the third time. We thank you for deliverance the fourth time. We thank you for the victories of January, for the way you made in January, for the blessings you gave in January, for the healings you gave in January. We celebrate your faithfulness, for the outstretching of your hand, 
which you stretch all through the month of January. We praise you this morning because you are not a disappointment. We bless you, we bless you, we bless you, we bless you. We glorify your name because you delivered us from challenges. Thank you for saving us. Thank you for delivering us. Thank you for the victories of February. When double trouble came, you gave us double blessing. You gave us double deliverance. You opened double doors. To you be honor. To you be glory. To you be adoration. We praise you for the month of March. We thank you for giving Satan marching orders out of our life. You gave troubles marching orders out of our life. You gave financial challenges marching orders out of our life. We return the glory to you. We return the praise to you. We return the honor to you. We return the adoration to you. Zalibinota, Amateli Kesha, Naribitu Gazgiria, to you be glory, to you be honor, to you be praise, to you be adoration. Maledi Tulzaya, Naledi Bukuzari, Madosha, Rikabo, Retozo, Bariketa, Barushadi, Taliboza, we magnify you. Awesome God, healer, deliverer, savior, the one who stretches his hand and no one can stop him, the God of gods. We bless your name this morning. We thank you because through our God we can do valiantly. It is him who has put down our enemies. We will sing your praise. We will celebrate your goodness. And we will never forget what you have done for us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Savior. Thank you for troubling our troubles. Thank you for giving us victory. In the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever you are this morning, I prophesy into your life that God is giving you victory in the mighty name of Jesus. Wherever you are, say amen today because there is victory in your house. You will trouble your troublers. You will be victorious over your attackers. You will have victory over the attacks and the attackers themselves. All the attacks and the attackers, you will have victory over them in the name of the Lord. Isaiah 59 19 wherever you are just be saying powerful amen this morning Isaiah 59 19 when the enemy shall come in like a flood the spirit of the Lord shall lift up a standard against him the spirit of the Lord shall raise a banner a standard a flag announcing to the enemy, surrender. I declare and decree this morning, God will raise a standard of victory. 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 Your attackers will be attacked. God will attack your attackers. God will trouble your troublers. God will attack your attackers, trouble your troublers. In Jesus' name, Jeremiah 20 verse 11. Some of you just read the scripture, so you want to repeat it. Jeremiah 20, verse 11, But the Lord is with me as a mighty, terrible one. Therefore my persecutors shall stumble. They shall not prevail. They shall be greatly ashamed, for they shall not prosper. Their everlasting confusion shall not be forgotten. Man, uh, Jeremiah 20, 11 is a complete prayer. And God will attack your attackers. God will attack your attackers. But the Lord is with me like a mighty terrible one. Therefore my persecutors shall stumble. Everything that I've come to persecute you. Ill health, challenges, financial battle, uh, trouble with your career. Shall stumble for your sake in the name of Jesus. They shall not prevail. You would win. You would win. You would win, you would win. You would win, you would win. You would win, you would win. They shall be greatly ashamed. In the mighty name of Jesus, weapons of darkness will fail for your sake, for they shall not prosper. Their everlasting confusion shall not be forgotten. Ah, the enemy will be confused. They will begin to fight themselves. 
The Bible says confusion broke out in the camp of Mount Seir, Ammon, and uh, the third nation that came against Jehoshaphat. And in the confusion, they began to fight each other until they destroyed one another. I prophesy, I declare and decree, ah, the Lord who troubles the trouble and who attacks the attackers will fight your case, win your battle, fight your case, win your battle, fight your case, win your battle. Jesus name, Proverbs 26, 27. Proverbs 26, 27, whoso diggeth a pit shall fall therein. He that rolleth a stone, it will return upon him. Anyone, anywhere who have dug a pit for you, setting traps for you, they fall into their own traps. Fall into their own traps. Fall into their own traps. Ayaba, Hiroka, Paredo, Toreji, Ibarra, Teiko, Prega, Kega, Predo, Tombre, Tenda. Everyone who have set a trap for you, they fall into their own trap. Anyone who rolled a stone, it returns on their head. 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 On their head. In the name of Jesus. Psalm 7, verse 15, 16. He made a pit. He digged it. And is fallen to the pit which he made. Verse 16, his mischief has returned upon his own head and his violent dealing shall come down upon his own party. Everyone who digs a pit of destruction for you, every trouble, every situation that is a setup, ah, that will be a lift up for you. They dug a pit. They don't care how big you are, they dig it. In African folklore, in my culture, they have the story those who wanted to capture the elephant dug a big hole and began to praise him, covered the hole, telling him, come and be king. He didn't know they dug a pit. And so as he saw the throne and as he's walking to the throne, he fell into the pit. Somebody had dug a pit for you. In your business or whatever, they will fall into their own pit. They will fall into their own pit. Talene moshkai, kalibare entali, branozono nkai, alibaro tolo kabariki toro mara talarike talabara toroza. And everyone who have packaged an evil load will carry it with their own head. They, it was a setup, but they will set themselves up. You will have the victory. You will have the testimony. You will have the victory. You will have the testimony. You will have the victory. Ah! God will attack your attackers. Nepako ziena, nebuja nerika, renuzo baki ita lika da ta ta ta. Libro to zona ita mbregedo zolibradisha. Hika pato zoti da lija. Psalm 18 verse 17. Psalm 18, 17, he delivered me from my strong enemy and from them which hate me, for they were too strong for me. He delivered me from strong enemies who hated me, for they were too strong for me. Everything that is trying to overwhelm you, every child, every Goliath, every son of Anakim, every Pharaoh that have boasted in your face, I will destroy her, I will kill her, I will eat her up. God will fight them, God will fight them. The giant that have fought your family, financial battles that have wrestled you and kept your dream in a cooler. You have great dreams. You have great vision. You can't carry them out. This day, I prophesy on your life. Now, that enemy that is bigger than you, God is bigger than it. Nadido, Ikada, Hileba, Toroza, Hileba, Hirabo, Hirada, Horabo, Ishkadi, Pradodo, Hiredi. In Jesus' name, I love Psalm 37, 17. Oh, I love Psalm 37, 17. I love Psalm 37, 17. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken. Somebody is about to put their arm in the plaster of Paris in the spirit realm. But the Lord upholdeth the righteous. Every arm that has been stretched 
in the realm of the spirit to hurt you, hurt your life, hurt your family, hurt your children, unseen hands, invisible demonic hands. There is the invisible hand of God, but there are invisible demonic hands trying to control your life like puppet masters. Patori and Deriba. Every puppet master hand. Psalm 37, 17. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken. For the arms of the wicked shall be broken. Every demonic hand trying to control your life remotely. You can't see the person. You can't see the thing, but it is controlling. Remote. We take authority this morning. This one, we break their arms. We break their arms. We break their arms. We break their arms. People can't travel away from these demonic arms because the realm of the spirit is a dimension. It is not uh, three hours, seven hours, nine hours in the plane <laughs> from Africa to New York. Well, 11 hours. A dimension means you can enter a dimension in, in less than a second. That's why the Bible says twinkling of an eye. The Greek word there is atomos, in an atom of time, atomos. So those who stretch demonic hand, you can you can travel away from New York and say maybe if I run to London, dimension. But also our Father lives in dimension. He lives in a higher dimension, greater dimension, power dimension, holy dimension, super dimension. Every hand that has been stretched. To fight you, God fights it. Nebo shall, for the arms of the wicked shall be broken. In Jesus' name. I love Jeremiah 17, 18. 17, 18. Jeremiah 17, 18. Let them be confounded. That persecute me, let them be confounded. <laughs> but let not me be confounded. I love this. Let them be dismayed. But let not me be dismayed. Bring them up, bring upon them the day of evil and destroy them with double destruction. Every enemy, every hand of evil, every satanic weapon that meant that, no, 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 you can't succeed. We must pull her down. If, because, if she becomes bigger, we'll not be able to control her. We send the fire of God. We send the fire of God. We cripple their attempt. We shut them down. We cripple their system. We shut them down. We cripple their system. We shut them down. We shut down the power of darkness. We shut down the house of evil. Amayero, Ikababa, Narikozi, Nataloba, Hiriborosha, Hiriba Katali, Harabatali Raba. Wherever you are, say Amen, say Amen. To many terrible attacks that are ongoing now, the Lord gives you victory. 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 Gives you victory. In Jesus' name. To terrible evil in the land that is coming against you, against the church of Jesus Christ in the country where you live. The Lord gives you victory. The Lord gives you victory. The Lord gives you victory. Because while men slept in the United Kingdom, out of about 40 cities in the United Kingdom, about 33 mayors are Muslims, while men slept and everybody smiling and calling it democracy and it is democracy medium mystic spirits are poured out on the land i've never seen all those are brothers only the church of my color shows up in parliament to protest any evil they stay in corners had for sure he called their church name and be dancing i am a friend of god they never come out while evil is spreading. Every terrible evil trying to enter your house and the land. We stop it by the fire of God. 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 You may not like Trump. I know a lot of you who are in America who are my color. You don't even want to hear his name. But he's the only one who is anybody. Get back there. All this confusion about male, female and 
another gender, I'm canceling it. Male is male, female is female. Sometimes confusion among politicians is something else. We need voices. And I pray that somebody will be able to do this even in the UK. Your vibrant, I mean, somebody is vibrant, dying like a fowl. We stop it by the hand of the Lord in the name of Jesus. Kaya Baba, gruesome attacks released on the kingdom of darkness. On your household, we stop it by the fire of God. 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 The fire of God. In Jesus' name. Coven attacks. They sit in their coven. They call your name and they are invoking all kinds of demons. And some of us, we are five minute praying people, 10 minute praying people. And we just say, I've confessed the word. It's not enough. Because even if you confess the word, from which, from which, from which chamber did you confess the word? From, was it from the chamber of holy fire? Holy fire. Because if it's not from the chamber of holy fire, the word in your mouth is as light as this paper. If I throw it down, you won't hear it. Because the Bible tells us, you just heard it because it struck the ground with the edge. Some of you heard it. Some didn't. The words that Jesus spoke, the Bible says it carried weight. You did have confessed the word and you go to sleep after five minutes, ten minutes. And we told you to pray and you are dragging foot. So this morning, wherever you are, let your amen be so fiery. Let it be on fire. Because all those frustrations without meaning, all those sudden business going awry, your child whom you raised in church, suddenly not wanting to hear about Jesus, suddenly determining his own terms of worshiping God, no sacrifice. No. <laughs> we got born again. Our pastors made us do all night, every day. And I was only 22 or 23. All night, every day. I pray for you this day. Every coven attack, we bring it to an end. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name. Please, we raise the prayer stake right now. And I want your amen to be again very powerful. That person on this platform who is going from one attack to another attack. From one trouble to another trouble. That days of smile and laughter has come. The days of celebration have come. From this morning, victory follows you. 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 In Jesus' name. I had unto. Libro kuzia bari. Nika parodosia. Ika marondi hidia. Libo teko bati jadi. Riku zambra tozi. Tika teko tobra. Libari. Libara. Rikosha. Every midnight attack that paralyzes you by day during daytime, you are already tired and you are wondering what is wrong with me. Receive victory from today in the name of Jesus. Every midnight attack that takes advantage of your weak moment, 
that takes advantage of your weak season. Receive victory. 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 In the name of Jesus. 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 Receive victory. I have a in Jesus name you're, you are extremely uncomfortable in life and every day you keep saying tomorrow 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 no 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 the Bible cannot lie it says he daily loaded with benefits from today we command a change attackers are attacked by the hand of the Lord troublers are troubled by the hand of the Lord victory follows you victory follows you victory follows you testimonies follow you anemeno alemena areketo irebada irebeda ebrano manoto irika abaro ishkaidaba tapa hota ikama eronoshkia your life is burning out right before your own eyes you keep telling yourself oh, I'm 44, I'm 46, and there is nothing to show. From this day, we take authority. We declare everything slowing you down, attacking your life, slowing you down, attacking your life, wasting your life, wasting your life. You're just going, wake up in the morning, you rush to work, you come back home, you have food, you watch television, you go to bed, you wake up in the morning, you rush to work, you come back home, you have food, you watch television, you go to bed. Nothing strategic, nothing major. Ah. Change is coming. Tababa, Hiroda, every attacker, every attacker, every troubler, take your, receive your victory, receive your victory, receive your victory, receive your victory, receive your victory. I am Koshabata. In the neighbor, your life burning out right before your eyes. You know, this enough. I see people. If I can just do this, if I can just do that, if I can just do this, if I can just do that, and they never stop. They never knew joy. They never knew blessing. Not your portion. In Jesus' name. All your family members are in collective problem. Collective. Wherever that witchcraft came from, we are returning it to the sender. Because sometimes it is while men slept that the enemy comes in. Right now, I remember the story of one family, loving family, good guy. One of the most sacrificial believers I ever knew. But we don't know when witchcraft came in. Somebody must have opened the door. Wife is on wheelchair, husband is demented, one daughter is... is has lost her mind and uh, another child is wild a fourth one they don't know how he got lost ah every collective problem victory 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 only collective testimonies have is allowed in your household every collective testimony you need receive in the name of jesus Every collective problem receive the victory, receive the victory. Adema no koto liba di katile kabarito runa di. Ayani kiko anakabato hini kabarete hiko sori bata hika yonavari taba asho taba ushka hini kabaro untali riba do raba di kita la riba ro do raba. Total victory. Total victory. Total victory. Total victory. Total victory. God must arise for you. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. 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 Be kosher. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered in Jesus' name. We raise the stake again wherever you are. Say amen powerfully. Every delegated dark angels, dark demons, dark agents mandated to carry out dangerous assignments against you. Just listen. Listen. Even when you read your Bible, you see there, they will say, who is going to go attack this one? Some will say, no, not me. 
The Bible says, and a lying spirit came out and said, send me. Every delegated dark agent, every small, small or big demon mandated to carry out dangerous assignments against you, scatter by the fire of God. They scatter by the fire of God. They scatter by the fire of God. They scatter by the fire of God. We release fire into their midst. We scatter their gathering. We speak your victory. 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 We scatter their gathering. We speak your victory in the name of Jesus. Every deadly assignment of dark powers against you, your family, your work, shall be aborted. It shall be aborted. It shall be aborted. Every assignment, deadly assignments to frustrate your dream, your destiny, your life. Abariguda, abarenota, evanorosha, ikatilibo, branukusoya, eremateta, ikabaroto, ibranitila, ikabaroto, ibranusa, ikiyanta, ibranusa, ikarusa, ikarenta, irota, irikaba. Victory follows you from today. Testimonies follow you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every power and dark agent reporting you to the evil world, to the world of darkness, we scatter them by the fire of God. 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 We Hayaba Mira Toshaya. In a cataliribo, or about a decaya, Icayada, Ida Baba Baba, Ida Borora. Every demonic dream affecting your life. Somebody on the platform, you've been having demonic dreams, finding yourself in awkward places, awkward experiences. Ah, today we dream. We draw the line between you and evil dream. We draw the line between you and evil dream. We separate you. 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 We separate you from evil dream and evil experiences in the name of Jesus. Ah. Every attacker, we send the Holy Ghost after them. Every attacker, we send the Holy Ghost after them. Every attacker, we send the Holy Ghost after them. Nana badada, hira bakasidia, hiri da 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 da, hika balorora, hira balorosa, hika tosha, hika tilira, hika liribo, ha yera da da da, hira da 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 da, hika lamantora, victory follows you. Jeremiah 2023 Jeremiah 2023 Jeremiah 2023 Behold the whirlwind of the Lord goeth forth with fury a continuing whirlwind it shall fall with pain upon the head of the wicked a whirlwind even before the bible came to my country Fathers in the land believe that there's something to some whirlwinds. Here the Bible now makes us to know there is the one belonging to the Lord. The whirlwind of the Lord goes forth with fury. A continuing whirlwind. It shall fall with pain upon the head of the wicked. This morning, everyone that have stretched their hand to fight your life. Karibon to zingetili inaida. Ranosh kati patu sapa yetila di. Jenadu turuna ke pro teka pe kosom pa itali. Let your victory be established in the name of Jesus. Let your victory be established. Today, this morning, I declare into your life, I prophesy into your life, powers that pull one down at the peak of success will not succeed in your life. Kabani, to Adi, Kabaru, Tabari, Anato, Parege. They are waiting for a person to ring the peak. Then they pull him down. Ah, pa, ho, hi, ha, ta, pra, to, shka, idea. Your sons will succeed. Your daughters will succeed. You will succeed. Powers that pull a man down at the highest height of success. We pull them down. 
we pull them down. Nakati ta shani ubaro ina bari daba abaro taleri ikata dorosa ishadi karota idadi tarida idadi tarosa hariki dorosa hariki torosa anera bota ika hapo umpra hinto umpra tashka yeda dark powers wishing you and your family dead before your time wanting to kill you the thief comes not but for to kill and to steal and to destroy every dark power wishing your death planning your death we send fire 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 the hand of the lord will sustain you kayenama nevarosha likeboro yanamaza hirabosha hireboroda every enemy on assignment to cause a havoc in your life in your family in your home they stumble and fall 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 they are on assignment to cause havoc in your home in your work in your life they stumble and fall 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 the name of Jesus every satanic power hindering your revival and restoration things went down business went down your life went down your spiritual life went down you no longer pray like you used to you no longer worship like you used to from today i re- i command the spirit of revival the spirit of revival to come upon you every troubler of your of your life is troubled for your sake every attacker is attacked for your sake in the name of jesus we don't need to know the root of the problem we just want to see the blessing follow from this day i declare into your life every heavenly star every heavenly star every heavenly star every heavenly star to arise and fight for you arise and fight for you the bible says that he commanded the sun the moon to stand still every heavenly star ah nabi yonanga desha Hira do ya da da, hira da da do ya, hinde do de do ya, ne de de da do da, hira da 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 da, hika ya la da da da, hire de do ka, hire de do sha, mambre ko, hire de da, hebrosa, hire do tala de de do do sha. I declare this day, let every weapon of heaven rise and fall, fight for you. Let God arise. Let the enemies be scattered. 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 Hira ba 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 ba. In Jesus' name. When, when, when Deborah and Barak also went to fight. The people thought this is just a woman. Ah! God decided to back that woman. And the Bible says in Judges 5:20, stars, the stars of heaven joined in the fight. The stars fought from heaven. The stars in their orbit fought against Sisera. Man, isn't that something else? When even the constellation is assisting you. Because you see, you may think they have no no voice. Everything in every kingdom has a voice. There are seven kingdoms. There is the kingdom of the constellations. They have voice. They joined in the war. The stars fought from heaven. The stars in their orbits fought against Sisera. Judges 5:20. God will use every element, everything necessary to win your battle, to fight your fight and win your battle. 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 God will use every weapon, every weapon to fight your fight, to win your battle. The person who boasts that they are bigger than you, your God will be bigger than them. The person who boasts that they are smarter than you, the God, your God will be smarter than them. The person who boasts that they will destroy you, your God will destroy them. Idabasha. Nikaleba, Rikodosha, victory follows you. No matter what the size of the enemy is, 
the size of your victory, the size of your testimony will be even bigger. In the name of Jesus, we seal these, these declarations this morning. We seal them with, with confession that we have the victory. We seal them by saying the word of the Lord will stand in your life wherever you are likely to begin to say powerful amen. The grace of Jesus Christ will manifest in your life. No weapon formed against you will prosper. Every mouth that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned. This is your heritage as a child of God. We declare into your life this day that God arises for you and God gives you victory. We declare into your life today that God makes way for you and nothing can stop it. We declare into your life today that testimonies follow you. We declare into your life today that the glory of Jesus shall be seen in your life. We declare into your life today that all eyes shall see it. We declare into your life today that the testimony of the Lord will be awesome in your life. We declare into your life today that doors open where you never expect. We declare into your life today that glory follows you. We declare into your life today that curses are broken in the name of Jesus. We declare today that you are an overcomer. You are not a failure. You are not a victim. You overcome whatever came against you. You overcome Satan. You overcome his weapon. The blood speaks for you. We declare today that you have total testimony. We declare today that God gives you victory. Not only does he give you victory, wherever you are, I want you to say amen to this. By the oil of Jesus Christ upon my life, I declare today that restraining order is placed against the enemy. He shall not touch you. He shall not touch your house. He shall not touch your family. Arrows of darkness will fail for you. I take the enemy to the courts of heaven. I report them. I summon them and report them before Jesus Christ, the author and finisher of our faith. I summon them before the courtroom of heaven. I report them according to the book of, of the book of, 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 of Daniel chapter 7. I bring them before the courts of heaven and I declare that you shall be adjudged right, adjudged righteous. For you have been cleansed by the blood of the Lamb. You have been saved by the blood of the Lamb. You have been washed by the blood of the Lamb. Your father is the judge. Your father who favors you is the judge. He adjudges you victorious. He adjudges you blessed. He adjudges you rewarded. He is going to give you victory. You will have testimony. You will not bow to adversity. Rather, total victory. We issue. Restraining order against the hand of darkness. Restraining order against the hand of darkness. We put a perpetual order against the hand of the enemy. By the victory that we have won at the Supreme Court of Heaven, restraining order is placed on the enemy. He shall not pass. He shall not see you. He shall not come near you. Your victory is enacted. Your victory is established. Your victory is announced. Your victory is pronounced. Your victory is profound. So shall it be. Testimonies follows you. Glory follows you in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. For I have received of the Lord that which also I delivered unto you. That the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread when he had broken it, he gave thanks. He said, this is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. For as often as you do this, you do show the Lord's death until he comes. Let him and examine himself. Let him eat of that bread, drink of that cup. Bless this Lord. Let it seal our victory. We overcome by the blood of the Lamb. We divorce ourselves from any form of demonic entity. We give back everything that is of the enemy. We save ourselves from any connection to the kingdom of Satan. We put restraining order on the enemy in the name of Jesus. Victory in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
Thank you, Jesus. When we go away, we have one or two announcements to make, and then we have another prophetic word to speak into your life for the weekend. In the name of Jesus, glory to God. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. Super Sunday this month is going to be something else. Last Sunday of this month, we are going to dance and celebrate the victory over the troublers. Super Sunday artist will be Mike Aremu. We will have a powerful time in the presence of the Lord. We will rejoice. We will celebrate God's faithfulness, answered prayer, healing, deliverances in the mighty name of Jesus. Make sure you wait for the confession before you go this morning. So join us. Put it down on your list. Be there. Sunday morning, Super Sunday service. Super Sunday, Super Sunday, Super Sunday. Ayadidida, uh, make it a day to be there to celebrate the victory of Jesus. Hallelujah. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. We've taught on wealth creation to business people for four years. The Lord laid on my heart to let many believers who have their own career and their own employment know you can create wealth as a person in employment or as a person who is uh, who is a career person we allowed people during the first session to do one of registration you can do another one of registration for part two it will practically radically change your life radically practically oh my when we started, it was very deep. In fact, I went extra mile. Instead of doing one and a half hours, I did three hours in that first session. Next session will be amazing. It is April 27, uh, 7 p.m. Make sure you write down the date. You want more details, you go to matthewshimelow.com. Make sure you invite your friends to join us all the time for Morning Glow. Let them experience the blessings of the Lord. Let them experience the favors of the Lord. Nakaye do shinabali kedito do da. Yida bo talada da. Yida do taliri ba katali keba. This weekend will be powerful. I'm telling you. I'm launching a new, uh, a new subject at life class. I want you to just show up and experience the new subject. It will practically stretch your mind, stretch your life. You will be blessed. You need to know the word. Listen, you need to know the word. Too many believers allowing themselves to just live a life that is on very thin slice of the bread of the word. You need chunks of the word of life to build you, to strengthen you. Sunday morning, Sunday 11 a.m. service also will be powerful. I'm sure you remember when I did a message on the unstoppables. Well, I'm about to do something that sounds like that. This 11 a.m. will be powerful, powerful, powerful. Don't miss it by any chance. In the mighty name of Jesus, you will be blessed. Your life will be really, really challenged. Glory to God. The big one holds in words and store and make sure wherever you live, the KRCC branch or chapel, be part of it and grow in the grace of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. So I speak into your life this morning. May your weekend be awesome. Before I go on, make sure you sow seed. Never draw from a prophetic service like this without reaction. God has a way of blessing you, of prospering you, sending help to you from the four corners of the earth, from where you don't even expect. In Jesus' name. So may this weekend be awesome. May your April be blessed. I speak into your life today. May truly the kingdom come in your life. When kingdom comes, it comes with power. May it come into your life. May the gates of your life be open for favor. Psalm 24 verse 7. May you reign in life and reign with your father God. Psalm 93 verse 1 and 2. I speak into your life today. May the blessings of the Lord rest upon your life 
And may the dominion of Jesus be seen in your life. Psalm 103 verse 22. I declare into your life today the scepter of your father's kingdom. Fire! Scepter is the instrument of ruling and power. Ah, darkness must not prevail. We are a people of a powerful kingdom. The power of that kingdom shall manifest in your life. I speak into your life today. Dominions will serve you. Dominions will obey you in the name of Jesus. Your father will break in pieces the powers of darkness. Your father will break in pieces the kingdom of darkness. I speak into your life today. Poverty will be strange to you. Say amen powerfully wherever you are. You were created not for just enough. No, 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 no. Have you noticed the way you were created? You're not created for just enough. Nothing around you is just enough. God didn't put one hair, one follicle on your head. He put zillions. Not one hair inside your nose. He put billions, millions of hair inside your nose. Though they are very microcosms. Everything God does is excess. This is your portion. This is your portion. The cell of your body is zillions. Every day some die and fall of another one replaces it. The intestine inside you is long, 22 feet. May you prosper. May excess follow you. May abundance follow you. May testimony follow you. I speak into your life, you will not be a slave to Egypt's financial system. That's the problem with many believers. And some of them don't know that's why we say come to the wealth master class. You will not be a slave to Egypt's financial system. You were created to walk in God's overflow of blessing. It is your portion. You were created to walk in wealth. God showed it. Slaves became millionaires overnight. Get ready for sudden favor, sudden blessing, sudden turnaround. I, dis I declare into your life today, the shackles of Egypt are cast off your life. I pray for you today, the power to get wealth rests upon you. As you seek the kingdom of God and his righteousness, everything you need to make life beautiful and colorful shall be added to you. Your life will prosper, your life will be beautiful, and your life will be awesome. You will not be put to shame. So shall it be. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Make sure you have a fantastic weekend. Make sure you take the time to challenge your friends to be part of our, our vision, our dream. Join us Sunday morning, even if you are in Australia, wherever you are. Be part of the KICC experience this Sunday morning. The Lord bless you richly and keep you. In Jesus' name. Koduvu Benis. The Lord bless you richly. Dio Steven Diga. Dio Steven Soe. Goana Akubariki. Onyamishra. Onyamishra Wai. Yebarikish. Yebarike. Mwariva kukumbrere wa mzita ra Yesu. Mkulunku uluwa gubusesi. Good morning. Saobona kunjani. God bless you richly. We'll see you in the Sunday service. God bless. Hey, all the way from Australia, God bless you. Praise the Lord. Amen. Bless you from Australia. God bless you, Heather. Heather from Australia, the Lord bless you this morning. Heather, may you be favored. From Australia, you joined us. I've never seen your name in Australia before, but may you be highly favored. God bless.